you have your glow peptides and you don't know what to do relative to reconstituting it and measuring it and getting it ready to actually administer it to yourself, here's what you're gonna need. You're going to need your glow peptide, you're going to need some back water, you're gonna need these syringes, and then you're gonna need these little alcohol swipes. So this little pot with 50, 10, 10, you're actually gonna put three milliliters of back water into here. And I'll show you how you do it because you have to actually make sure that you're doing it along the side of the vial so that you're not damaging the peptide. So we take off the top so that you have just a little gray stopper there. You're gonna put the syringe into the very center and you're going to extract one milliliter at a time. So I do that three times. Be careful because these needles are small and they tend to bend. Now when you have it completely full to the one milliliter line, you're actually going to take this, you put it into the center hole and you're gonna inject it right along the sides so that you're doing it very, very gently and you're not damaging the peptides because they are pretty fragile. You have one done and you're gonna do that two more times. So you have to make sure you're not using this needle to inject because you want that to be a really, really straight needle. You want three milliliters. If you go through any of the online peptide places, you'll probably have to buy all of this stuff. You do go through Facebox, she sends it to you as a package and she gives you instructions. She's available for a call if you need the support. Then you give it a quick swirl and then these are ready to be injected. This to the 20 units and that's gonna be my daily injection as I get through two of these vials, which should be about eight to 10 weeks. I'm going every day, but I've heard people do five days on, two days off. I'm gonna inject it into a fatty area. I'm really gonna pinch up a fatty area gonna put it in a 45 degree angle and then immediately afterwards you'll probably feel a little bit of burn. I'm gonna grab some castor oil and I'm gonna massage it for about 30 seconds. I have a video on that. I hope this has been helpful. If you have any questions, drop them in the comments. I'll talk to you soon.